Hello makers and tinkerers. Today, we're gonna to make a smart plant robot. Using light dependent resistors, we're gonna make it actively seek out more light. Let's get started. First, let's talk about what you'll need. For this project, you'll need an Arduino Uno and a motor shield. You can also use a Nano and a motor driver. As for mobility, we need two motors and tires, two support wheels, a base to set everything up. I got this as a kit, which makes it a bit easier to assemble. A power source. I'm using two batteries, four light dependent resistors, or LDRs. These are going to help our car see the light. And of course, your plant. Next, let's assemble the base. Put the motors in. Then put LDR modules in. Place them on different sides of the chassis. Make sure they're evenly spaced, as they will detect the light intensity. Then, put some electrical tape over all the metal surfaces for safety. Let us upload the code before we make the connections. Project link is in the description. Copy the code. The project needs the Adafruit Motor Shield library. Install it from the library manager. In the code, you can adjust the speed of the robot using this value. Then, we read the LDRs and determine which is the brightest direction. Then, turn the wheels to go in that direction. Then upload the code. After that, let's put the Arduino in and connect everything together. Connection diagram is in the description and the pin references are shown on the screen. Next, connect our battery. When using external power supply, put the power jumper pin in. Make sure to adjust the sensitivity of your sensors according to the brightness needed for your project. Now it is calibrated to that brightness. Put our plant in place and turn the power on. Now our smart plant should turn in the direction of the light. This can be very useful if you have plants that need a lot of sunlight. You can also add a soil moisture sensor and make the plant even smarter or use the analog input of the LDRs to make the robot find specific bright areas and move there. Let me know in the comments if you need part two.